I'm Dr. Bobby Redwood, emergency physician and subject matter expert on opioid stewardship and medication safety for the Superior Health Quality Alliance. Understanding the risks and benefits of opioid pain medications is a CDC best practice and a step that can sometimes be overlooked when a patient or family member is suffering from acute or chronic pain. Now in the emergency department, one of the most common opioid side effects that I encounter is fecal impaction. It's a severe form of constipation where a hardened ball of stool blocks the rectum so that regular stool cannot pass through. Now these stool balls are routinely the size of a softball. In some cases, I've seen them grow the size of a volleyball. Treating fecal impaction involves a very unpleasant bedside procedure where the emergency physician repeatedly inserts a gloved lubricated finger into the rectum to scrape away at and break up the hardened stool until it is in small enough chunks that it can be removed manually. Now this necessary but universally uncomfortable procedure can take up to 30 minutes and causes a sore rectum and sore anus for up to a week afterwards. Fecal impactions are rare in the general population, but common in patients taking opioids, especially elderly patients and patients residing in long-term care facilities. Staying hydrated, eating a high fiber diet, using stool softeners, and staying mobile throughout the day are all strategies to prevent fecal impaction. That being said, your best chance at avoiding this side effect is to minimize or eliminate the opioid pain medications from your pain management plan. Bottom line, if you take opioid pain medications and have ever been constipated, you are at high risk for this most unpleasant side effect.